ladies and gentlemen, Sheldon Dingwall. How are you doing, Sheldon? So good to get to get a fresh start in 2021. What valuable lessons have you learned from 2021? Oh, boy. How important personal values are. This is probably the least sexy topic you could possibly um, have a conversation on. But, oh, my God. Uh, are personal values ever important in how we interact as, as people? If you have people in your life that don't share the same values, then, then there's always friction and tension between you that extends to just trying to understand each other. So for instance, if I'm going to convey an idea to you, you're going to build a mental picture inside your head as I'm speaking. And so there's going to be a lot of, of, uh, a lot of content that's implied that isn't actually spoken. And the closer our values are, the closer your mental picture is going to be to my mental picture. And if, if we have the same mental picture, well, then, then we're doing great. But uh, if, if, if a person's values are out of sync or completely different than yours, it's just such a struggle to communicate your mental picture and have them understand where you're coming from and then communicate back to you. And, and uh, that's something that really became apparent this year. Probably because of the extra, extra stress of COVID, it's put everybody under stress. And when that happens, you tend to default to, to your lowest common denominator as, as, as what you find functional as a human. So in other words, you know, I like to de design guitars. And so when I get stressed out, I'll do that and I feel better. Other people, when they get stressed out, they'll eat ice cream and that makes them feel better. So there's always something that you default to. 2020 has really sort of uncovered people's compatibility. And, and uh, I've heard that there are a lot of divorces because of it. Being aware of the value system that we all have possibly even forgot to optimize in the past or have taken for granted, the value system is like a kind of a, a great like base snack, right? Every now and then, you're going to have to adjust that tension rod to deal with the weather situations or a different gauge of string situation. Things need to be adjusted accordingly. And, and, and the value system thing, like you say here, I think this is the principle that all dreams, all businesses, all relationships are based on to start with. You know, this, this will dictate uh, longevity. Find a way to extract what we consider to be the best of the situation or there will be no growth. 100%. Yeah, growth is important. If you're not growing, you're, you're shrinking and withering. What do we have planned here with Sheldon Dingwall and the Dingwall Company for 2021? Drop me some stuff, man. What's going on? In two years, we've tripled our the size of our facility. We are continuing to improve every single day on our on our custom bases. And our goal is to to, if not double our production on custom bases, at least get our our two year back order list down to you know a yearish. And I'm you know that's been a goal for a long time. The Hellboy and the D Rock five string standard um, will be dropping soon. Those things are they're so cool, and I can't wait for people to get a chance to make music with them. We've got three more designs on the on the drawing board, plus some hardware, some new pickups. It's hard to say right now when we'll actually uh, be able to announce those officially, but they are in the drawing boards, and and uh, we'll be prototyping soon. We'll have physical samples ready probably within the next six months. Give me a hopeful message for 2021 moving forward. I've lived through the housing crisis. I've lived through the, the tech bubble when it exploded. And I've lost my, my entire shop to a fire. You know, we'll get through this. I call it um, shotgun theory. And that is when you shoot a shotgun at a target, the pellets don't evenly disperse. There's clusters of pellets that hit one area and then there's negative space where nothing hit it. 2020 was a cluster a cluster of crap that, that was just just all building up to go wrong. And, and it finally went wrong, but we're going to get through it. Then we're going to have, you know, a clear space for a while. And we'll be able to get back to business and, and get back to creating and living our lives in, you know, with hope instead of living them with this shroud of fear. That's what's on the way. It's, it's coming. Right on, brother. And I, I believe what you're trying to say is the word we've been cluster fucked it's not my show it's okay for you to say it it's just i didn't feel it was my place yes but that's exactly what i meant 